What's up, everybody? I'm Kelly Fly, and welcome back to Life is Strange. Oh, go ahead and leave. Be on our way, I guess. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... This is still really scary. Why is the end of the tunnel so fucking scary? Okay, let's just, um... Why did the... Waiting for you, Kate. Oh my god, okay, let's go ahead and read around people's, uh... We miss you. Okay, you know, that's just a... Tiger, tiger. I better go meet up with Chloe. Shh. I hope you burn bright again soon, Kate. Tiger, tiger, burning bright in the forest of the night. What immortal hand or hand or eye could frame thy fearful symmetry, Blake, or Kate Marsh? Where you go. There I am. Whose room is this? I don't remember. We'll wait for Kate, Brooke. Okay, good. I, I expect that from Brooke. I think that's Victoria's? Where you go. There I am. You're creepy bitch. Jesus. It's all just... I have to be extra crispy careful so I don't get caught outside the dorm this late. Okay. Okay, so let's just avoid talking to people. Okay, we, we can just keep moving. Hey, can you come in here for a minute? Okay, fine. I trust you not to say anything, Dana. Hey, girl. Hey, Dana. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. I knew she was depressed, but I had no idea how bad. Must be serious to throw yourself off the roof. Kate was serious, but it's not all about that video. So what exactly are you saying, Max? You think this has something to do with Nathan being expelled? It's real complicated. It's complicated. I don't want to drag you into this, okay? Not yet, anyway. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. But she didn't buy into that shit. We're not involving her, and I'm not- <sighs> Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Going through her shit. Ooh. <laughs> Juliet waiting for you, Kate. Uh. No. No money. No. Something. I, I can't read that. Damn it, it's too small. Uh, Kate. Just want you to know you're in our thoughts. God, I don't like the noises. It's fucking creepy. Praying for a fast recovery, Kate. Considering all the crazy shit I've done the past days, sneaking out is nothing. We're going to her shit. Oh, it's so creepy in here. Fuck. Since I've crossed the line from Snoop to Detective, I might as well search for clues about what really happened to Kate. These socks cost more than my wardrobe. <laughs> I'll title this one, Portrait de la Assholes. <laughs> Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. 
Yeah, I mean, I never saw the video, so I don't... No, but yeah, she looks... Uh, not okay. Not like a... Victoria is about as straight as me. <laughs> but she really appreciates style. I mean... <laughs> yeah. A unique point of view is right. Thanks to Courtney Wagner ghostwriting this paper. Noir and day exp um, expressionist photography by Victoria Chase. God, where is she? You know, she's not completely horrible. I guess she has some problems herself. First with. Rachel and now Kate. This is the end of the Vortex Club. I mean, it just doesn't... To me, it's no excuse for being a fucking bitch to everybody and doing the shit you well, do. Oh, well. Victoria and Taylor actually show remorse. Hey, sweetie. What up? Uh, I'm just avoiding some lame-ass science homework. How can anybody do fucking homework after somebody almost jumps off of um, jumps off a roof? I can't believe we all saw it live. It was like watching a reality show. Oh, my fucking God. And I've never seen the campus so quiet, like everybody hiding or afraid. Yes, I feel like total shit for everything I said about Kate in that stupid video. Let's get some peeps to meet up later. This girl needs a serious curfew cocktail. We'll drive to Kate. We'll drink to Kate. You know, it doesn't fucking excuse the shit you did. What a trip. Um, that was the day. Seeing Max and Kate like that, I need a drink too. Let me know the time. XO, sweetie. There's no fucking excuse. You fucking- you- You're part of the problem. This is like a thread for sociopaths. Max Crackfield? Lame. Party on, dudes. That- okay, from Nathan to Victoria, that Twimo bitch Max- Max Cogfield? Really? Okay, fine, whatever. Uh, got me fucking suspended, can you believe it? My dad owns the fucking dorm where she's- uh, when she plays with her selfies. <laughs> my parents have lost their shit and are threatening me with a fucking job in my dad's office. How dumb is he to have me repping him? Max Crackfield and Blackwell need to go fucking down and the end of the world party is fucking on you in. Cheers, Prescott. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? That is bullshit. No way can, uh, no way can Blackview, uh, Blackwell suspend you. I knew that Max was trouble the first time I saw her ass-kissing ass Mr. Jefferson with the retro cam era. Bitch, how many times have you been kissing on his ass? You would lick his fucking shoes if he let you. you shut up. Fuck it. God damn it. Notice that everybody she hangs around gets in trouble, and yes, the Vortex will bring the end of the world uh, to Blackwell no matter what. I'll SMS you later so we can plot in person. Hang in there. The oh, God, I hate you people so much. All of you, I hate so, so much. That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. Uh. Victoria's Secret. She's a geek. Oh. I mean, it's no big deal. So what? She's a bit of a geek. Here they are getting loaded with Satan. Of course. Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> Nothing to see here. I guess I shouldn't be so bummed. Not that Victoria couldn't hide her shit. Man, I'm getting paranoid. Okay, I didn't get caught. All right. I mean, I don't think. Okay, why not? I don't think she'll say anything. And if we, if she does, then we can just reverse time. Hey, Max. I saw you go up on the roof and save Kate. I can't believe she tried to jump. Mm, okay, we'll comfort her. I can. I'm just so glad she didn't. Are you okay? I'm just like shocked. I've never seen anybody try to kill themselves before. Me neither. I didn't think you'd be so upset considering how much shit you and Victoria gave Kate. I'm my own person, not Victoria's bitch. Hello, like she's freaking too. She already broke curfew tonight. <gasps> shit, I'm not supposed to tell anybody. 
I won't say a word. I swear to dog. I believe you, Max. Besides Victoria, you're the only one who asked me about my mom in the hospital. That meant a lot to me. I'm my own person, too. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks. You're like weird, but pretty cool, Max. Especially after watching you go up on that roof. Victoria's wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. And now I feel bad. I mean, she did still talk shit about, you know, Kate and all, but... Is the heart behind it? What the? Okay, fine. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. And not get caught in the process. So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. Hmm. Alright, let's get, uh, let's get moving. I don't think there's really much to do out here. Now, why won't they fit? These keys are all broken. Maybe it's me. Principal ah, Wells, oh, are you serious? I'm, I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. Not yet, anyway. Fuck. So let's see. I know I have a set of keys on me. Somewhere. Max the ninja strikes again. We're good. Everything's fine. <laughs> I was a little afraid. Like, how the fuck am I going to do this with reversing? Like, but I mean, it worked. We had enough time. All right. Booyah! Jesus, woman. Get it? Boo, yeah. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. More like a scary punk asshole. Hey, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing, and your badass power is gonna save us all. We just need to connect the plays. And find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. That doesn't control... Oh, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? I don't know how this is going to be phrased. Oh, Rachel. We need to find out more about who Rachel was involved with around here. She was able to blend in with everybody, even with people I hated. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Kicking it, I, uh... uh alive? I have to think that, Chloe. Her spirit is so powerful here. Maybe too much power. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, step prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just... I don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. 
Why didn't you just groan? Okay, anyways, I wasn't the only one that saw that there were lights on in the building and then went off, right? Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... That's right, dumb bitch. Are you fucking kidding me? That's what you get for trying to blackmail someone when you literally have nothing on them because I can tell that he did not fucking, like, he's not doing any shit with you. It's so stupid. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. <laughs> Let's go find out. I mean, it's already been real, but... I'm sorry, I had to take a moment to... Admire what was happening. <laughs> God damn it. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Not to mention the weed you brought into my room. Joking. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? I get charge us for just entering i'm serious we could go to jail not if i'm related to the head of blackwell security step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police so we better find out what's in the principal's office first you can rewind if we get caught right you have mad powers max i can only powers didn't save kate maybe i did on my own come on one more door and our work here is done Okay, we're going to have to save the rest of this for the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you want to see more from me, why not subscribe? And I will see you all next video. Bye-bye.